Pratika. My name is Pratika Mohol and in this video I would like to go over the three types of split jumps. Um, let me show them to you. Uh, well, it's the vertical, the directional, and the alternate feet uh, split jump. So then after I show them to you, I will go over the debate that's out there in the badminton world about these three types. Some say there's more, some say there's less. So let me show it to you. I put a black line here on the floor so that you can see my uh, the reference point on the ground. Um, the first one is the vertical, which is straight up and down. The common split jump, right? That's the vertical one. The second one is the directional, so you step out like this, or you step out like this. That's the second one, the directional. The third one is um, the alternate feet. So you do like this or you do like this. Now, the debate comes in um, whether there's only three types or there's more or there's less. And I'm going to go over that with you right now. Okay, so the vertical jump, some say that if you just go straight down, that's one. And if you come up and down, that's two. I say they're the same. Um, I don't care if you're going up one millimeter and then go down, or you come up three inches and then you go down. It's all the same, it's vertical. Um, the directional foot split jump, I say there's two. There's this way and this way. Some say that, well, there's two corners in the back, so you have to go this way where you point your toes outward and you go this way. So, one, two, three, four. I don't do this because of it. So, um, I just do the one, two because I backpedal to get to the back court, so that's all I use. Now, the alternate uh, feet uh, split jump is used uh, by a lot of players, but coaches in the badminton world will say that it doesn't exist. I say it does because it's used. Okay, um, where it's used is in situations like this. So you come, you hit a clear, a deep high clear, and you're walking back to your base, and you go this way, right? So you don't have time, or you don't want to land and load both your legs at the same time, because now that just takes extra time and energy. So all you do is you come back and you do like this. It's kind of like a scuttle. So watch. Head, walk back and this way, or you do the round head, hit, you walk back and you do like this. See, so you don't land with both feet at the same time. You just kind of do and push off or coming this way and you push off. So those are the three types of split jumps. Um, the reason why I'm showing this to you is because there's a new to intermediate players will think that there's just one type and that's the vertical and uh, there's more out there. There's more. This is why I like teaching badminton movement. This is part of badminton movement. Uh, that the split jump, that if you understand what the purpose of the split jump you'll get away, get away from thinking that there's just one type of uh, split jump, that's the vertical. Um, the split jump, just as a side note, is sole purpose is to load your muscle, your leg muscles, so that it can push off, right? It loads the muscle. I don't know how else to explain that. Okay, um, I hope this was helpful. Thank you for watching.